that is our like bad joke on like earthquake at Haiti and stuff. That was, it's terrible, and we're terrible people, and that's why we did it. <laughs> did any of your Pokemon hit level sixty yet? Um, not yet. Yeah, me neither. I was like, from yesterday till now, like, the, nothing still got to level 60. Well, we're working working on it, I guess. Well, like, what, we started, like, last, yesterday we started off with, like, um... Level 54 at the least, maybe, I don't know. But, yeah, like, 53, 54-ish. Well, I guess now, like, I leveled up, like, six, maybe, like, four... Or five, six levels ish per Pokemon. So, like, that's four or five, like 20, you know, like 24 ish. Yeah. So, we in there, basically. Nice, the champ and Jolteon both died because he got uh, recoiled. Nice. Hey, wait, what, what's your moveset on Alakazam? Like, Psychic, Dark Pulse, um... Uh, Thunder Punch and, uh... Combine? Combine, yeah. I mean, I guess the Calm Mind's the only thing that I probably wouldn't be using that much. Yeah, because you're going to get one hit KO'd anyways. Yeah. Pokemon fight, ready, go. <laughs> nice. Wait, oh, are you in, still in the cave? Yeah. Okay, I'm just wondering. I think I'm higher level, but you're, like, now, like, really taking in that lead. Yeah. Go, my super bug Pokemon. I'm like, yeah, what the hell could you have? Oh, Heracross. Okay, okay, we're getting somewhere. I think it has, like, Heracross, Pinsir, maybe Scizor. Yeah, probably. Something... Along those lines. And maybe we, probably for fun, we should have put like a, uh, like a Caterpie. Oh, nice. Or even a Cascoon. Oh, no, never mind. He has a Dustox. A Heracross, <laughs> a Dustox, and probably a Beautifly. I don't know. The hell, what the hell do you have with a Dustox and Heracross? <laughs> well, nothing. I mean, you're st if you're stupid. Okay, no, it has a Pinsir. Okay. Okay. Man, I, I'm I'm really dreading the next gym. In the fire type gym? Yeah. I mean especially with Oh wait. <laughs> right now I could just I'm versing explode, right? Um, yeah. you know how big its mouth is right now, right? <laughs> yeah. I use like um solar beam and then, like I could imagine if the animations were still on it would just like solar beam into its mouth. That'd actually be amazing. <laughs> I would pay to see that. Uh. Okay, I'm on, I'm I'm on the last part, the last section of this place. Uh good luck with that. Oh, I mean, considering all the shit that you gotta do there. By the way, I taught my executor, like, um... 
All right, TJ. I taught it a uh, solar beam. Do you think that's a good idea? Um, yeah, I, I think if you bring out your nine tails and then okay, yeah, that's what I've been doing. <laughs> yeah, that's it's actually kind of smart. Because whenever I have um, whenever I'm, I made it so like when I need to like use an item or like use a lucky egg, I put it on both of them at the same time. So then I just put nine tails out first and then switch to. The other thing, to Exeggutor. So first, I could get the chlorophyll to actually work, so I could outspeed stuff, at, and then I could, uh, you know, solar beam if I need to. Yeah, it works. Whatever, whatever uh, works for you, I guess. Whatever floats your your boat. Whatever sensors your hentai. <laughs> oh my god, I. Do you know? Do you know Jack's films? Or no? I've heard of him, but not, I don't know anything about him. He he made this one series that that I, like I like I was watching like a, not too long ago that was really funny called Your Gra Your Grammar Sucks. Oh, I've it's, heard of that. Like everything is just terrible, but he also made something like recently called like um. Like sort of a question of the day kind of thing. I forgot what it, what, it, what the series is called. Um, and the question was like, um, instead of you know, like you know, people say like that really grinds my gears. Yeah. There was like, what could we make instead of grinds and gears? Like someone's like, it's like uh, that really censors my hentai. I'm just thinking, oh, <laughs> it's it's uh it's great. Dude, this Typhlosion's only using Quick Attack against me. Nice. I don't know if we made a mistake or something, or if that's just this Typhlosion being stupid. I'm just gonna assume it's it being stupid. Because <laughs> I know it has more moves than that. Oh, Battle of Blaziken and Yanma speed boosting. <laughs> Yeah, well, it sucks for you that you... Did you at least give your Blaziken uh, Rock Tomb? Uh, I... Ow, I actually didn't. That's a good idea. Oh, uh, I mean, uh... No? <laughs> <laughs> you know, you really suck at lying. <laughs> or yeah, trying to play cool, I guess. Which is probably the reason that you figured out I wasn't in your Mr. Gengar's class. Yeah. When I, when I say stuff like that, that's when you figure, <laughs> you know. <laughs> Dude, how how is this ninja ass like outspeeding me so much? Even though I've been speed boosting throughout the entire Yanma part, and it's it's now just, you know what? It's faster than I thought it would be. Anyway. <laughs> Man, I got a five-turn confusion. Luckily, oh. I hit through, like, three of those, but still. By the way, uh, you know how you said you would, like, watch the recording? Like... Yeah. You would do it just to, like, see if there's any evolutions? Uh, yeah. Okay, wait, wait, wait. My brother's calling me right now. I'll be right back. So just, just stop whatever you're doing, okay? Okay. Actually, I'll go to the bathroom, too. I'll be right back. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, never mind. Way too loud. <laughs> Yeah, Andreas. Oh yeah.
Yeah, wait, 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 don't do anything yet. Let me just... Okay. Yeah, okay. Um, yeah. By the way, you know, you know how you're gonna have to cut this part out? Uh, yeah. Uh, that's gonna be fun having to run through all of this again to try and find it. No, it's fine. Are, no. are, are we done yet? Are you done yet, or...? Okay, on go. Three, two... Wait, hold, oh, hold on, hold on. Uh, okay, just count it down. Okay, on go. Three, two... Go. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You'll probably keep in that one countdown part just to. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you'll probably put like a, as like maybe some text on the screen just say like, no, this is piece of sh. <laughs> 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 yeah, no, it's fine. Really, honestly, I don't care. Oh, Sky Uppercut, here we go. Oh, what level is it, 59? Uh, yeah. Get rid of Bulk Up, maybe? Or Slash. And slash is okay. But... Well, it's not really... No, I, re I would get rid of Slash instead. Okay, I guess I'll get rid of Bulk Up when I get uh, Overheat. Oh, yeah. That awesome moment when Charizard intensifies the sun rays, but you use Rock Tomb against it anyway. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Hey, does Sharpedo have better physical or special attack? I still think it was originally physical, but we changed it to special for the hack. I don't know if that's true or not, though. Uh... Yeah, actually, I actually have no idea, but right now it's uh, special, and um, Sharpedo is the only thing on my team that can learn Earthquake. Oh, good. I'm I'm glad because. Well, why don't you look at its stats? Maybe that'll help. I know it has like 144 physical attack, so like I was like, I don't know if I should teach it or not. I'm just do it. It's 144 is pretty good for this oh. point in the game, I guess. Well, what's your like highest physical attack? You know what? Um, because if it's close to your highest physical, and I was like, okay, then fine, I'll do it. But um, I'm gonna guess that it's either Blaziken or Crobat. So let me see. Uh, I think I think it's Blaziken. Uh, yeah, so Blaziken has 167 attack. Okay, yeah, so no, it's not even close, so never mind. Yeah, um, what's its special? Uh, 166. Oh. <laughs> okay, then. Wait, you said your, phys your highest is 167? I think so. Yeah, I think that's what it was. And what, you're level 58 or 9? It's level 59 right now. Oh, okay, good. Oh, shit. Bent that. Hmm. <laughs> I got this, uh... I'm just using fly against slacking. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> it's trying to use swagger on me. <laughs> like, oh yeah. Because every other turn I'm hitting. It's gonna you. use skill squat, skill skill swap on you. Trust me. No, it just kept using swagger. Well, then it's stupid. I don't, I don't know what to tell you, man. It's it, you're stupid. I'd say in a good way, but not really. By the way, did you ever think Pidgeot is, like, a good flying type? Um, I thought it was okay. Well, do you um, think it's, like, I don't know, it's, like, do you think it's as good as, like, 
the other uh, like Firo better than Firo I I'd say it's better than Firo I'd say it's not as good as Do uh, Dodrio yeah no um how about Swallow and uh, I'd say it's probably better than Swallow I don't know though I'm not really like an expert at Swallow though. Um, crap, I was going to say something. Oh yeah, by the way, for the, um, for the, for the routes, tw uh, 12 to 15, as well as the water routes, we ran out of ideas for Pokemon, because route 12 to 15 were full of bird catchers, and routes, um, 20, or sorry, 19 to 21 were just entirely made up of, uh, water trainers and you, you can you only get so much before you just completely run out of things to put i mean come on how many tentacruels and stuff oh yeah by the way primate in the oh, water water is like the most common type though yeah but you still run out of like a decent team idea for so many trainers hey wait, wait, wait andres i'll be right back okay what's going on now no my brother needs me again uh okay <sighs> Okay, I'm back. Oh, wait, are we, are we going? Wait, 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 let me just... Um... Wait. Hold on, man, while you were gone, I was... I went to Crash Man stage, I'm fighting Crash Man now. <laughs> Okay. Give me a sec. Still fighting. No, are you gonna are you gonna give him that JV four stock? Uh, I, I might. Do you know what that means? Uh, when you four stock someone, I don't, I don't know. Oh yeah, it means to four stock without taking any damage. Oh, I I I did take damage, but I. Andreas. You know what? <laughs> <laughs> Almost done. Sort of. A long fight. I, I I could easily take no damage. The only reason I I um the only reason I do take damage is because like I feel oh I can get another hit in and then like I I, I get hit. But other than that, oh, just... oh. <laughs> I was gonna say um Polonius tried to get the JV four stock when instead uh Hamlet got the reverse four stock. Okay, so like, let me explain that. So Polonius right. tried to force stock him without taking any damage, but then Ham like Hamlet. Should, should, should we should we start now or? Okay, yeah. Okay, three, two, one, go. Okay. All right. So basically, we were just explaining uh, in Smash. Um, <laughs> <laughs> we, we were saying that like um, Polonius in Hamlet. Um, he tried to, um, he tried to, um, JV4 stock, uh, Hamlet, but then, which means to, like, you know, 4 stock without a, taking any damage, so he tried yeah, to yeah. do that, but then Hamlet's like, yeah, no, on his last stock, you know, just before he's gonna die, he's like, yeah, no, he, he's down, like, 1 stock to 4, and he's then he just starts going ham and just um. <laughs> no, um, he starts going ham lit. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So he goes and he pretty much he starts taking one stock, then he takes another, and then he now it's back to even one stock to one, and then you know Hamlet pulls it off. So he was down one to four. Making a, re a reverse four stock means you're down one and you four stock him back without taking. You know, oh man, that's that's powerful as hell. Yeah, that's when uh, Hamlet, you know, kills Polonius through the uh, thing through the <laughs> curtain. And I, I, you know, I just want to point out, we've been making fun of.
Polonius a lot for the hell of it because he's just a character to make fun of. I will be brief. Then <laughs> he talks for another like five. <laughs> Whoa, it's level sixty-eight Grand Bull. Oh yeah, I mean, I guess that one's not too bad. I must be honest. Uh -oh. oh, I rode my bird here in the water, or on like this one land patch in the water. It's funny. I I remember a lot of people like whenever they see that like scene between a. Uh, Groudon and Kyogre, and they're like, uh, Groudon clearly has a disadvantage on here. Like, well, I mean, you know, he he was so, like, warm and hot that he, like, made, like, a little patch of, of land wherever he walks in the water. Like, that's... I feel like he's, like, overpowering Kyogre there. Yeah, I feel like kind of Kyogre's water... Like, it's pretty much Groudon's solar beam versus Kyogre's, like, water-type moves, like Hydro Pump. I think their uh, Kyogre does win that because, you know, at least Kyogre gets stabbed with it. Like, Groudon. Yeah, I guess. I guess. And again, it's pretty much whoever gets sent out second, and their, like, effect is in, you know, their weather effect is in effect. You, you know, you know, it's funny that I know that um, magma is, like, comes from the ground and it's like, like, like magmatic rocks and stuff like when it gets really hot in the surface of the earth but why was team magma after groudon like why was magma after a ground type it just i i still feel that they should have been after a fire type well because they wanted more land oh i mean maybe the, like i don't know the the land itself would get creamed by the water but if they had a fire type, it would still get creamed by the water, but at least it would heat up the water. I don't know. I feel like that would make a little more sense logically. It's like if you wanted to make more land, so you just threw a bunch of land in the water, versus if you wanted to get more land and then you like you you got like some magma to the water and heat it up and turn it to, into stone. I don't know. I mean, if that's the case, then, like, there needs to be, like, a third legendary that's not, uh, it's not Rayquaza, but it's, like, this, this, uh, grass type that just comes and, like, creams both, uh, Groudon and Kyogre. Call it, a uh, Team, Team Bio that's going after it. Yeah, that's not our idea for the next hack at all. Oh. It's <laughs> <laughs> actually, like, there hasn't been any team that specialized in... Okay, well, I guess most teams don't really specialize in everything except for Magma and Aqua. Other teams, like, just use mostly, like, just, like, a bunch of types that they find. Oh, nice. Well, it's true. Oh, it, oh, unless something happened, but... They use a bunch of types. Well, yeah, they just, just a bunch of types. Like, Team Rocket had, like, Poison, uh... Some of them had, um ground and and rock and stuff some some had a uh, no just normal wait so where are you right now seafoam uh <laughs> did you, you find any of the water type trainers uh, I fought like a like small amount because like I I can't deal with so much water. Two seven point eight <laughs> out of ten. <laughs> yeah, I'm so happy we changed Tyranitar's ability to uh, intimidate. Oh, what was this ability normally? A sandstream. Is that are you saying that ironically or? Do you actually, would you actually prefer well, that? Sand, sandstream summons a sandstorm, and it's, like, so lame. But I know it can be useful, but, like... I mean, like, if you're if you're in a double battle, it would hurt you. Well, no, people use, like, Tyr Tyranitar in double battles for, like, you know, if oh, they yeah. have a sandstorm team. No, I think that uh, Tyranitar in conjunction with something like uh, Clefable with um, Magic... Magic Guard, I think that's what it's called. Would actually be pretty good. 
because you know, like it blocks it blocks it from from uh, indirect damage like uh, sandstorm and whatnot. Like literally any weather condition, poison, burn. It's awesome. Oh, my Beedrill outsped Yanma. Nice. It's like eight levels lower. <laughs> you go Beedrill, I guess. I mean, don't go Beedrill. I, I want you to die, Beedrill. <laughs> no offense. So we go through Seafoam. We just go in this random place and... Yes, I know like, that, you know... You're already, you're already done Seafoam? Yep. You fall down this hole and guess where you end up? Right in the gym. <laughs> like, <laughs> smack down in the gym. The gym music starts, like, blasting out. It's, it's awesome. <laughs> uh... In all of its trumpets. Jesus, dude. Are you, are you like, level 60 yet? Uh, nope. Oh, okay. Damn it, man. You, 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 you trying to imply something with okay? No, not at all. Shut up. <laughs> the fuck up. I uh, mentioned Master Roshi, and then I skipped the text because I didn't forgot about that. Oh. Oh, this is actually going to be really bad because I have Swampert out because it has Rock Tomb. Problem is, yep, Charizard with Solar Beam. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm just dead. I'm just dead. I'll get. Let's get Thunder out here. Let's see if Thunder hits. Oh, well, okay, we'll hit Thunderbolt and then we'll try Thunder. Oh, th Thunderbolt almost killed, actually. And all of its Fire-type attacks. Now the entire team's Fire-type attacks are going to be boosted, and all, all Water-type attacks are going to be lowered. Yeah... I did not come entirely prepared for this battle, if I must be honest. Uh, well, let's see if I can outspeed it with Alkazam and Thunder Punch. Yep. But Thank what are you going to do for the rest of the fight? Eh, we'll see what I can do. I can always use revives. Uh, Blaziken I, I can kill with Alkazam. If it... If it hits... Okay, good. Outsped. Man, remember when Blaine was like the easiest gym leader for so far in the game? Yeah. Remember when that was actually a thing that he could be known for as being a crappy gym leader? Yeah, now Matt. he's actually pretty good. I think he's... Do you think he's harder than the last gym? Mm, I'm gonna say it's more annoying because you have to go all the way to Seafoam and like go through all that if you fail, but I wouldn't say harder. I don't know. I'm a little iffy on that. I know Garkine's gonna use extreme speed on me. I know it. Yes, I knew it. That's why I healed. It's good.
All right, so I'm versing all the trainers on this water route. Yeah, I know. Wait, are you gonna do it later? Probably not. No. <laughs> Nice, I critted uh, with Earthquake on the Arcanine. Magmar level 70. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh my god, you can't be serious. A Ludicolo used Ice Punch and it froze me. <laughs> Piece of shit. Yeah. Love it. <laughs> 